bright hope. It's more than a place where I worshiped with my grandmother. It's the spirit of resilience that's always lifted me through good times and bad. Even as a little girl, bright hope sparked in me. It became the story of my life. And bright hope is the story of America too. Through some of the changes and challenges we faced in all of our darkest hours, bright hope keeps America moving forward. And it kept me going through my own darkness. Charles was the love of my life, a brilliant and beautiful soul. Every morning he would say, good morning, and he meant it. Charles had torn his Achilles tendon and something went wrong. Blood clots traveled to his heart and lungs and then he was gone. And for a while, I was gone too. But one thing Charles always said was you gotta get your mind right. So I did. I decided to run for Congress. That's the thing about Bright Hope. It can make you do crazy things. This is what coming together and moving forward feels like. It's been the greatest honor of my life to represent Delaware, to protect our seniors, our environment, our small businesses, and women's reproductive rights. Yeah. But we've got so much more to do. Many of you have seen this scarf. Imprinted on it is a Returns of Qualified Voters and Reconstruction Oath from 1867. That X was signed by our great, great, great grandfather, a freed slave. I carried it with me on the day that I was sworn in. And I carried it with me on January 6th. With the house under siege, I prayed for love over hate and hope over fear. Congresswoman Lisa Blunt Rochester kneeling in prayer. Her praying was one of the most powerful images from the siege. People ask me if January 6th was my worst day. It was, but it was also one of my proudest moments because we walked back in that house chamber and we completed our work. The forces of fear did not win and democracy prevailed. And now I'm running to represent Delaware in the United States Senate. That little girl from Wilmington couldn't have imagined that we'd be standing here today with a bright hope for our future. A more perfect union is not a destination. It's a journey. Let's go on it together. Yeah.